morning guys so please don't mind the way my hair looks or like literally anything because i just woke up from bed and uh, today is gonna be a whole day of cleaning and like getting everything sorted because for the last one week i haven't been doing anything other than office work so my entire house is a mess i don't get it honestly i feel like shit because as much as i love designing jewelry that is also not literally everything that i want to do in life i want to do so many different things and not being able to film for youtube not being able to film for instagram and like focusing on uh my mom's brand and stuff like that it has been weighing down on me so much i am trying to have a little bit more balance in my life when you see my videos you think that uh, my entire life is all put together even though you can't see it many things are a mess it's just one day of the week that i get to film and stuff and i honestly want to get things sorted so in today's video we <laughs> we are getting a new couch uh, obviously like i told you i'm not buying the couch i'm just renting it out i rented it for 9 uh, months so i'm going to be having it here if i stay in this house for 9 months i'm going to be having it for 9 months if not i'm just going to take it to a different house guys those flowers we have a lot of flowers at home so these are roses baby's breath and i do not know what this white flower is these are carnations and uh, i don't know the name of this but so we have these and my entire house smells like fresh flowers and i'm loving it so i just woke up so i'm going to go make some breakfast and then sit and work on this label that i've been trying to design for my mom's brand and uh, then we're going to start cleaning the house and that's when i'm going to take you guys along so the monsoon is here and with all the good things and the rains it can really put your skin through a toss and uh, this is the season which can cause a lot of clogged pores breakouts and all these skin issues and it is also really important to protect your skin so you need to find a skincare product that effectively works and i also feel like a lot of people these days are into multifunctional multi purpose skincare products which will simplify your skincare routine rather than using seven eight different products uh, in your skin so the dermacos new range has done a really good job with that and thanks to dermaco for sponsoring this part of the video so i am talking to you guys about the sally cinnamide anti acne face wash and the salicinamide anti acne serum so as the name suggests salicinamide is obviously salicylic acid and niacinamide so salicylic acid is usually meant to treat acne and niacinamide is meant to treat marks the formula is amazing they put both into one single product which can effectively work on your acne and acne marks together the packaging the pump packaging is so convenient to use and the face wash firstly this is so good to remove the excess oil from your skin unclog the pores and reduce breakouts every time i use this face wash my skin feels so healthy and fresh and the salicylic serum has 2% salicylic acid and 5% niacinamide so the salicylic acid especially targets your enlarged pores acne breakouts and blackheads as well niacinamide is an active form of vitamin b3 and all of us know that vitamin b3 is very good for your skin and niacinamide not only fades discoloration in your skin but also reduces the acne mark So after I cleanse my face with the salicylic uh, face wash, I take a few drops of the salicylic serum. You literally need very few drops of it, and I apply it evenly on my skin until it is nicely absorbed. So you can use this serum both in the morning and night, but I recommend using it in the night and following it up with a broad spectrum sunscreen in the morning. So your purchase from Dermago not only enhances your skincare routine, but it will also contribute to a noble cause. Let me tell you how. The Dermago has empowered 10,000 plus young students. students this year through their young scientists initiative for every product you buy from them they will uh, link your order to a child whom they uh, educate along with boomi so that way you're not only investing in your skin but also in the education of a child and also i recommend doing a patch test before using any of the products and all products from dermoco are fragrance free that way it makes it so much more gentle to use and if you use my coupon code which is ananya2023 you get it 20% off on their website and this code is applicable only on their official website Right? but you can buy dermoco products from nike flipkart and amazon so i will link all of these products in the description box below so make sure you guys go check it out
six in the evening. I know I started walking at ten in the morning, but then I just like fell off and I started resting, chilling, mostly going through a self care day. Not really doing any kind of face masks and stuff, but I was honestly just journaling, and I was also reading this book. It's called Change Your Life with NLP. Uh, this is actually my sister's psychology book, but then I started reading it. I'm still not even through the first chapter, but I think I kind of like it. It is a very different perspective, and it's good. And guys, the situation right here is kind of bad. You can you see this? It's like a whole bed sheet. And pillow situation. I'm just honestly taking up as much space that I want to in this hall. Uh, so today my couch was supposed to come, but then unfortunately they kind of postponed it to 12. It's gonna be a Tuesday, so it's, I will be at the office. I do not know how I'm gonna, uh, you know, get the sofa here or anything like that. We're gonna get some help and like try and figure that out. So I will have to start cleaning the room and then. I uh, will have to go clean my kitchen, which is like my least favorite part. And I'm also trying to give every single thing in my house a place to go to, because everything doesn't have a place yet. And I'm just like randomly throwing everything, and that's exactly why I think my house gets messy. And then later today, I'm just planning to go do a little bit of shopping because I'm honestly craving some retail therapy. So yeah, maybe some clothes. It's been so long since I got any clothes for myself. So, so I'm gonna go do that. Uh, I will probably not take you guys along. Let's see. So let's get started with the cleaning. that I have at home and this is the place that I'm planning to put the sofa in. I ordered a smaller sofa so that it could fit that place and everything here is a little too out of place but I'm gonna fix that. So this is usually how I segregate my clothes for laundry. So all of my whites and light colors go in one pile and the rest goes into the other. So these are usually the ones that I think are a little bit problematic to mix with other colors and these are the regular ones. So that's usually how I do it. Done. This is what we have to tackle for right now. And when my space is this unorganized, forget being creative, forget being anything. I just like can barely think. So I will have to clear this up. And uh, these drawers are still uh, empty mostly. So I'm planning to put all of my skincare and everything that I would use in these drawers so that it would, you know, like clear up some space from here. I'm just planning to clean this up and go shower and leave. So this is the OOTD and it is honestly giving Sophia Ritchie met shirt girl vibes. So this jeans is from H&M Divided and this top is from um, the store in Commercial Street. And this bag is from Miniso. It's a nice tote. I feel like it goes with the entire soft girl aesthetic. So I'm just gonna head out right now and I will see you guys. I went to H&M, that's actually why I went to the mall and then I also went to Zuria. I also wanted to check out uh, Miniso but it was too late and everything was closed. So let me just quickly show you. My dad's always complaining that he would wait one hour outside a store and I would come out 
picking nothing and that's like a problem that I have. Let me also show you guys what I got uh, in commercial street day before yesterday. One was the shirt that I was wearing yesterday. I folded it up neatly and kept it inside. So this is like a basic blue shirt. So these kind of shirts I've rarely worn but uh, I feel like it could be my aesthetic if I style it properly. I don't really think it suits my body type when I wear thin materials but this one has a really nice thick fabric. It has tiny little checkers on them. Uh, so the next piece of uh, clothing that I got from Commercial Street is from this brand called Bershka and the tags are still intact and this is the um, cardigan or like top or whatever. This screams spring and summer and I absolutely love it. I have been wanting something like this for a really long time where I could wear these low cut or like halter neck crop tops and wear this on top. It looks so good and the material is amazing too and I think Bershka is like uh, probably an English brand or like a European brand I'm not sure but I've seen a lot of influencers from London especially by clothing from Bershka so I am guessing it's an English brand then the next piece of clothing from Commercial Street is this uh, halter neck brown crop top it's so adorable it looks so tiny it is this ribbed material so like obviously it stretches so much so these are the kinds of tops that you find a lot in Commercial Street and sometimes the fitting can go really bad and sometimes it can uh, fit you so perfectly moving on H&M stuff we have these pants I am so happy that I got this. I may or may not have had Barbie season in my head when I got this, but it is a really nice loose fitted pink pants. It's a baby pink, beautiful color. It has a nice flare and it also has this uh, cutout in the bottom. Surprisingly, this pant was in a size XS and it fit me so well. My favorite color to wear in clothing is pink and when I wear pink, I just like feel so happy and so girly and free, if that makes sense. So the next two pieces of clothing that we have from H&M is actually from the kids section. Like I usually don't pick up clothes from the kids section, but I always try to try it on and see if it fits me. And this time, usually it doesn't, but this time it fit me like so perfectly. So the first top is this one. It again has this ruffled um, sleeves and also this ruffled bottom. I feel like you can just roll it up when you wear it and wear it like a crop top as well or also wear it like a mid-length top and I just love it. I can't wait to wear it and like style it with jeans, cargos and a lot of many things. And then the final piece of clothing from H&M is this red, basic red top. Again, this is from the kids section. It says some, I guess nine to ten years old and i have no clue how it fits me but it does and i love this color on me as well it makes my skin tone pop and also i got just like one top from zudio and it's this nice lemon green or like a light green colored uh, top and when i got this again i imagined wearing it with a cargo and even like skinny jeans that i don't usually wear and i absolutely love the color i mainly got it for the color and maybe a little bit for the material it has got some sort of self design print on it and yeah. I just got back from the office and I wore this top and I completely forgot to like show you guys because it was like a rushing in the morning and but it was so cute. I love it. And today's task is to organize my kitchen, clean up my kitchen. It's been so messy since the last two days. There are vessels from yesterday in the sink. I think it's gonna ruin my mood, but we can't help it. We have to clean it all. I also did stop by uh, the organic store after office and I got some rosemary and I uh, just like add this in mashed potatoes and pastas and I love making hair mist out of rosemary and I just like spray it on my hair and it makes my hair grow so fast. Then we also have this toothpaste from Bentident and like an extra toothbrush. And then we have some ghee. I just had to restock on ghee. I went to the shop. There was this Anna in a tallu and I asked him what all uh, you know greens he has and I asked if he has moringa assuming he doesn't know Tamil and he was like illa but I have sirikira, arakira, tandakira like he just kept going on uh, 10 15 names of kiras and I called my mom and, and I was asking her which one I should pick because like I was so confused and I made him repeat the entire thing and I told her 
everything on phone and she was like I don't even get all this here and I might have made her a little bit jealous so we have some of this it is so fresh and I feel like I'm officially at this age where fresh groceries make me so happy yeah I'm gonna go quickly change and come back and clean up the kitchen and make some dinner and for dinner I'm planning to make some sesame toast I saw this recipe on Instagram uh, real so we're gonna make that for dinner so let me go quickly change and come back and I also got a new helmet my old helmet broke uh, because of my very rough careless handling they also had a pink color in this but every girl is wearing a pink helmet so i just like picked up red so just showered and uh cleaned up the entire kitchen in and right now i'm gonna start cooking so this was actually the video that i was like talking to you guys about Yes, it's literally like so easy and I'm gonna start making it and also I just realized that I do not have potatoes at home so and this recipe's main ingredient is potatoes so I'm gonna make uh, I'm just gonna use paneer instead of potato I really hope that tastes better because I that's all I have for now <laughs> Let's cut some bread. It's like 8 30 in the morning and right now we are getting our sofa delivered and i'm super excited for that so before they come i have something to film for instagram we have 20 minutes left for me to start getting ready for the office so i think i will probably be able to finish at least half of the reels okay guys i just got ready to film the reel but they're here so we're gonna get the sofa first keep it inside and then start filming so let's go and it is huge than I imagined it to be uh, so we had the same thing in the color purple but I didn't want to get purple because in a house of this size a purple sofa would be like an entire color block so this is actually how it looks I rented it out from this website called Falenko I'm gonna put some nice white and pink cushions on it that is the plan I just got ready for the office I know I look exactly the same but I am showered I put some makeup on and it's, I'm different okay and I'm just having my breakfast right now it is actually a mango smoothie uh, and this has like one mango in it some spinach and some dates and milk uh, that's all that I put in there no added sugar I know I'm already gonna be five minutes late but we're gonna drink this really quick we're gonna chuck this and leave it's actually really yummy. I've never dared to add spinach into my smoothies, but I finally did and I think I'm obsessed. So, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!